Well, I'm from Auckland, but I've always wanted to live down here, so I made the move 11 years ago. I came backpacking to New Zealand from the States. Fell in love with New Zealand, and when I got to Queenstown, I just loved it and wanted to stay. Somehow or another, a few years later, we came across each other. Got married, had two kids, and needed a bigger house. We know what it's like to build a home. We've um, been through that process several times. We got into our dream home. We love when someone else comes to us to realise their dream like we did. It's like exciting for us to be involved in that as well. We've never built before. We wouldn't have known where to start. They've done so many builds that they were able to help us so along the way and guide us along the way. Mel was amazing. I, I found myself vocalising a lot of what I wanted. I was like, oh, I kind of want this. or. Uh, but I couldn't quite see how that was going to look. And she would have seen something on Pinterest or had something that they've done in a previous build or, and she'd show me and say, oh yeah, no, that, that's exactly what I want. The key to success in an architectural build is having that really good relationship between builder, architect and client. We have this special relationship. We communicated every single problem or issue or even come up with better solutions. We design a lot of high-end um, houses and we trust Mel and Rob can handle anything really. I, I trust they could build it. I think I, I trusted the fact that Mel could put a house together and I knew that Rob would get it done quickly. <laughs> The design had some challenges because it had um, access to the side on a lower level. So we tried to use this feature and put all the living areas in the house as high as possible to open up towards the views and the sun. During the build process, when you're finally standing up on the floor and you could look out and see the view, Rob said, oh, maybe you might want to frame a few of these windows to kind of take in the view a bit better. So a few of the things that changed along the build are things that I really love about the house. From, you know, the foreman who was in control of the site to Rob and to even Mel and the girls in the office. Everyone knew us. Everyone knew what was happening with our build, when the painters were coming, when the floors were getting laid down, when the doors were getting installed. It was good communication. It happened so quick. There was deadline. I think the roof was supposed to be oh, on it. by mid-January. You know, the roof was on by before yeah. Christmas. So there was things we where were ahead of schedule. Ahead of schedule. Yeah, we're... the build process was really it was all easy. Really easy, wasn't it? <laughs> they had they had an amazing team. The guys were so easy to work with. Josh was as enthusiastic as our build as I was. You know, I'd come on site and he would be like, oh, I can't wait to show you the stone workers in, or can you believe this? And, you know, so he was really passionate about the build, which was pretty cool. That kind of kept us pretty excited about it. Some of the architectural features in here actually is that the entrance way with the, we had to pour a set of in situ concrete stairs. I mean, that's the first time I'd done something like that. But seeing that come to life was, that was awesome. My dad's a stonemason and I love stonework and I wanted to get as much of that within the budget that we could allow for. So I really wanted a shift fireplace. I wanted that fireplace. I guess the main things that we we're looking forward to with building this house was, for me, was the outdoor entertaining area. So um, my plan is to, you know, have plenty of parties and entertaining out there. I like the flow of the house. I think the entranceway is, is amazing. And then the separation of the house so that bedrooms and the wings are all at the other end, but it all flows. We're just proud of what we've created. We're proud of what we've handed over to our clients and, and the clients are, are super happy. They are, they are ecstatic about what we've handed over to them, which fills us with even more pride. The clients trust us with so much of their dream and we've been able to create it. We had no issues with communication and they knew exactly what we wanted every step of the way and they made it happen. Just the feeling that I get when I come home every day is happiness. You know, love the home, come home to see the family, crack a beer. I'm proud of us to get it done. Yeah.